Hello everyone, we will start installing SQL Server 2017 Developer Edition. Here is the link to download SQL Server. I have put the link in the description. Now the installer file has been downloaded. We have three options basic, custom and download media. So I have selected custom edition. It will ask for a path. You can choose any path. Okay, I have selected my path. and select install first it will download the uh, package or sub setup file then it will start automatically installation okay since it will take some 5 to 10 minutes i pause the video okay now download it successfully The whole installation process it will take almost 4 GB of space data in fact 4 GB of data it is required so make sure your data is ready now let's start with installation SQL server new installation since it is a new instance we are going to create first time It is a developer edition. I have selected developer edition. Just give Windows Firewall, it is not an issue. Select all. We are going to install all the features of SQL Server. We, we need to provide here the instance you can provide the default instance or named instance I have given here the named instance SQL Server 17 MS SQL Server 17 make it the default option this is also not required to change anything make it default it is better to give the password here it should be like num numeric okay, special characters in the combination you need to provide that This is the path. This is the default path. We are storing the log files. You can change those path also. Put next. For analysis service, I have selected multidimensional. You can select as your option, maybe tabular mode, you can select. It is integration services scale out configuration. Just remember the port.
डिस्ट्रीब्यूटर रिले कंट्रोलर जस्ट प्रोवाइड द कंट्रोलर नेम I have selected Microsoft R option that is R language so you have to accept that one because it will install automatically and uh, in fact it will download the separate installation file for that install so you need to accept that one. Yes, you can see here uh, we are giving the consent to install Python. It will download the package or set of file and install automatically. You can review your installation files here and click install. Now installation starts. It will take almost 10 to 15 minutes to complete the installation. Let me pause the video. Once it will complete, I'll show this. Okay, installation is almost done. You can review uh, the, uh, all the installation files here. What got installed. And all the uh, green color tick mark represents it got installed successfully. That's all for now. Next step is to install SQL Server reporting services. Always install it from the SQL Server installation center which will come default during installation this will redirect to your download uh, set of file link so download SQL Server 2017 set of file This will be around uh, less than 100 MB file. It will take some time based on your internet speed. It got downloaded here. Install reporting services. Select developer edition which is free. Next, 
accept license terms so now click install next step is to install SQL Server Management Studio download the setup then install it will install SQL Server Management Studio and it will take some 10 to 15 minutes once it complete restart the machine so I have restarted and started SSMS you can log in with authentication or Windows mode, Windows authentication here is my instance select ok I have selected SQL Server authentication mode and please give the password now click connect ok it is now connected now we can see the instance here so SQL server is installed successfully next we will install SSDT go to SQL Server installation center always click on the link there it will redirect you to proper path so go down ok download the software SSDT standalone installer it will install all the three analysis, reporting and integration services so download the link here also given the instruction how to install so open this software by default SQL Server database is checked so other analysis service reporting integration we need to select it will automatically point ok it will automatically point to your uh, instance now start first it will download the progress package the whole installation process is almost 15 minutes based on speed ok after installation 
actually I skipped this uh, process after installation you need to restart it it will restart your system okay, I have restarted my system you can see here it got installed Okay, you can skip for now. Choose your color to set up the environment. I have selected general. It will configure for fast use. Now you can see file new new project. See our component in the intelligence analysis, integration, and reporting. All the three features are installed. So this is to install SSDT.